One of the most random things that I have ever seen trending on my timeline ever is that Nancy Reagan, former US First Lady, <laughs> is the throat goat. If you don't know what that means, if you're not hip, that means that um, she was very, very well known for BJ's of the oral kind. Um, I was like, wow, that's so random and disrespectful to say. The only thing more random than that is finding out that it was actually true. I didn't have to do much research at all. Uh, apparently she was known on the MGM lot for her oral sex powers. Nancy Reagan. I've never even pictured anyone with that classic short haircut, them synchronized swimmer haircuts. I never considered them, I never even pictured them having sex or let alone the oral. She was known on the MGM lot for her oral powers and her biographer even talks about it. She said she would entertain people orally. She was known to give the best BJ in town. And this is my favorite. Uh, it said she performed oral sex not only in the evening, but in offices. That's very interesting to me because those two things aren't opposite at all. You'd think, oh, she didn't only perform oral in the evenings. She did it at breakfast time as well. Or, you know, she didn't just perform the orals at the house. She did it in the office. He said, not only at night, but in the office. That's code for just all the time. She was just all the time. And that is a tough thing for your wife to be known for. Even Too Short dropped a bar about it, which is messing my whole timeline up. <laughs> I know, I, I know they were, you know, active at the same time, but you just don't think about these things that Nancy Reagan and Too Short were even in the same place, let alone a BJ was involved. I just, I, I did not wake up today expecting to, to, to see this, but you never know. That's what, that's what I like about the BJ community. You never know who's a sleeper, who's a, a sleeping assassin. You never know.